we went for a ride. <laughs> you have now experienced the death wobble. I really shouldn't. We have a lot of work up ahead of ourselves and uh, we counted everything out and at the rate that we're going, we're doing about right now with with not being set up into production mode two timbers a day and we've got like 300 so that puts us at about 150 days worth of work with timbers if it's just matt and i it's a little bit longer than the initial timeline that we've countered out yeah so and and we we need to try to get weathered in of course before winter before next winter and so far where we're putting the structure there's trees there still yeah so Long story short, we've got tons of work ahead, and we need help. If you want to come up and you want to help us uh, plug away and see a little bit of Alaska, we've got a place to stay, we got a wood stove, we got sourdough Sunday pancakes, we've got all kinds sourdough of sourdough bread. We like got sourdough every bread every couple days. It's pretty good. Yeah, we're looking at for people to come up roughly uh, end of March. Yep. <laughs> If you, if you want. <laughs> so if you want to come up and learn how to do this stuff and help out with it any way that you can and if you want to make a trip out of it and see Alaska and have a place to stop and yeah, we need help. We need help. We'd appreciate having anyone that wants to come up and spend some time and, and like I said, this is a pretty fun thing to, to learn and to do and I guess this is just a plea for, for anyone out there that wants to come up to Alaska and if they do, and we can pretty, pretty cool transition too, coming from dead of winter to icky melting snow to beautiful summer and uh, long days and beautiful hiking and scenery and uh, uh, I don't know, just Alaska in general is a pretty neat place. And if you hear the dogs hustling, bustling in the background of this audio, they are currently in the middle of a, a tussle. Yep. Yep. So. Okay, so this is this is what we're working on, and uh, this piece highlighted in red is the one that we finished. That's the very corner. So you could see there's still a lot of white here, a lot of white to do. All of the white ones are ones that we haven't touched yet. <laughs> Literally. I mean, we've touched them. We've moved them all. Yes, we've moved them several times, but that's a story in and of itself. Um, so this is the one piece that we did. This is the next piece that we're working on right here. Um, so that'll be two pieces complete tonight. And maybe maybe we'll get to uh, laying out another one. Um, so that's kind of the big picture. This is what uh, this is what we're working on. Hopefully, throughout the throughout the time here, more of this building will turn into this crimson red. We need to get our bottom cord of our truss down and it's this big 10 by 10 by 20 feet. Uh, by 14, it's a, it's a, I think 10 by 14. Oh, it's a 16 footer. So that's a 16 foot beam, not 20 foot beam. And uh, this is how we're gonna do it. We've got our mini X in here with our little nubbin. And we're gonna try to lift that uh, beam bottom cord up and place it on these cards. So it's gonna be a little bit of a dance here. We'll see if we can do this. Perlin, Eve Perlin 1. Complete, bro, that's a nice looking timber. My goodness. 
Look at this nice little angle on here all the way down. One last thing I got to do. Mm. Bottom cord of the truss is planed, squared off. We got the reference and adjacent face. Basically, you pick the most square side and that's where you pull all your measurements from because, um, so for example, right here, you kind of, even that, this is our more square side. You could still see a little bit of, a little bit of a gap coming through there. And then some of this stuff, it's coming out of the mill this way, but same thing. You can kind of see a gap, gap there. And that's not even the worst of it. Look, for example, that one. Look at that. I'm, not, I'm talking to myself. So we pick out the most square side and that's where we pull all of our measurements from. from. And uh, we're gonna have to start to do layout on this tomorrow. We're finishing early to go help out a neighbor.